Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I will share with you how I made these lipsticks from scratch. To achieve the same results, please make sure that the measurements of the ingredients are accurate. Here I have my digital scale ready. I place my glass beaker on the scale. Then I put 8.6 grams of castor oil into the beaker. I add in 4.6 grams of jojoba oil and 3.6 grams of my pigment mixture. You can use any color of your choice. I mix all ingredients together till they homogenize. Then I add in 1.6 grams of beeswax to the mixture, 1 gram of candelilla wax, and 1 gram of canoba wax. I move on to the next phase and melt the mixture using the double boil method. When the waxes are completely melted, I remove the beaker from the pot and place on my scale. I put this mat on the scale because the beaker is very hot. I add in 1.6 grams of rice bran oil to the mixture while it is still hot, 1.2 grams of refined shea butter, and two drops of vitamin E oil. Mix well so that all the ingredients are blended together. When they are well blended, we move on to the next phase, which is to pour the mixture into a lipstick mold. My lipstick mold is made of three sets, a plexiglass holder, a silicone mold, which I place in the plexiglass holder, and this aluminum ring, which I place on the silicone mold. Before pouring in the mixture, Please make sure you oil the silicone mold and the aluminum ring with sweet almond oil so that the lipstick can be easily removed from the mold. Now that my mold is ready, I mix the lipstick mixture for some few seconds again. Then I carefully and gently pour it into the molds. After pouring the mixture into the lipstick molds, I immediately put them in the freezer for 20 minutes for it to set. You can also place them in the fridge for about 40 minutes. Personally, I prefer to put them in the freezer. After 20 minutes, I take them out of the freezer, prepare my lipstick tubes, Then I first carefully remove the ring. Put this part into the lipstick tube. And then carefully remove the silicone mold. Allow it to harden for three more days before using it. On my left, I used rose and pink pigment together to create the lipstick and on my right, Bordeaux pigment. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please do give it a like, leave a comment, share the video, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for your support. Bye-bye and have a wonderful day.